the Warren Center is. It's a hybrid academic uh, industrial drug discovery engine. It's made up of classical academic scientists as well as industrial scientists that have all come together at Vanderbilt to bring modern drug discovery into the university environment. And obviously with that, we've had to, to redevelop a lot of our, our approaches and strategies. And so it's really informative to people both in academics or in industry that are doing drug discovery. We have everything you would find at a major pharma company. For chemistry, there's analytical HPLC, there's automated normal phase reverse phase chromatography, there's photochemical reactors, there's microwave reactors, there's supercritical fluid chromatography. In the DMPK lab, all the in vitro DMPK is run by robots and then bioanalysis on triple quad mass specs. With molecular pharmacology, there's multiple flipper detector systems, robotics, everything to be make everything as automated as possible. We have a great mix of people that have industrial experience as well as uh, people that maybe come right out of groups here at Vanderbilt. We hire students, we hire postdocs that come and just matriculate into staff scientist roles. We have people across all disciplines. We have medicinal chemistry, molecular pharmacology, drug metabolism, behavioral pharmacology. And across each of those domains, it's, it's about a 50-50 mix of people with industrial experience in the pharmaceutical industry and then people we've kind of homegrown trained that uh, we pulled right out of Vanderbilt and the surrounding areas. So it's a great mix of people across all disciplines. And by building this the way we did, it, it's really big team science. It's a highly interactive environment. We talk with each other all the time. And because of that, if a project has different priorities, we can change on a dime. We can, we can modify the, which assays are being run. We can change priorities in DMPK slots. Things that when I was at Big Pharma were very hard to do just because everyone was under a different management structure and spread out across a four-mile campus. Here we're all in one building, and it's just very easy to, uh, to change when we need to.